Hey, come on in. Welcome to the first home tour and sneaker collection video. Today, I'm really gonna be showing you guys where the magic happens. So here it is. I own a one bedroom condo with my fiance. She's not here right now. Yes. But I'm gonna show you guys my shoes, my clothes, everything. I'm also gonna be giving away a few pairs of sneakers, so stick around to the end of the video for that. But here we are, this is the kitchen, the first stop on the tour. I actually use this kitchen all the time. I genuinely do have a passion for cooking. It's not the biggest, it's not the best, but this whole space that you guys are seeing is, is temporary. I won't be living here forever, so it'll do for now. And here is the main living area. This is the couch that I game on and watch TV. Um, and these are my house plants that are honestly become like my pride and joy as you can see There are big windows at the back there, which are absolutely great um, For living in but bad for filming in because they the sunlight changes 24 7 and kind of messes up the shot Regardless, this is where we spend most of our time Nicole and I and I'm just really happy um, With how everything looks so far. Oh and guys, I finally got my hands on my first YouTube plaque Yes, of course. This is the bedroom uh, the boxes are not normally there the only reason why they're there is because of the collection part of the video which we'll get to in just a moment um, but yeah large windows as you guys see here and then my closet is behind me there's always two mirrors over them which I rarely ever show um, but let's get into it and here is the setup I have two Amazon shoe racks at the bottom which are stackable uh, they're normally full but some of the shoes are over there I got clothes in the middle and then I have some extra shoes on top let's get into the collection now though. don't forget giveaway at the end of the video Video. We are gonna start off with some shoes you guys have yet to see before on the channel um, We're also gonna be running a counter. I genuinely don't know how many shoes I have But right now we got the New Balance 2002 R in the basement colorway um, This is a new pickup that I just got recently lots of New Balance uh, in this video I just picked these ones up as well. These are the new 19 06D or 1906 R 1906 R and then I also got it in the white with the black heel. I highly recommend these if you uh, do get them. Next up, I picked up a black pair of the Adidas Samba. Um, just for reference for um, videos coming up, I'm gonna be doing an Adidas Samba styling video and then a, uh, a New Balance styling video right after that. So subscribe if you are interested in seeing those. Uh, this is like a deep cut right here. And these are the Tiffany Dunk Highs, uh, the Diamond Dunk Highs. This is how you do a Tiffany shoe, not those new ones that they have coming out. Those ones, uh, I, I don't know, I don't like them um, and they're very expensive. The idea and the concept of, of it was cool, but the execution, not so good. Another Dunk High here, uh, those are SBs, these are just normal Dunk High. These are the uh, Nike Dunk High Light Chocolate. This is the Nike Air Max 95 in the neon colorway. This is one of my all time favorite sneakers. I wear these all the time to the gym, casually, you name it. This is a pair of the Adidas Forum Low 84 in the green colorway. I cut the straps off these and I think that they look uh, much better. Next up, we got one of my favorite and most worn sneakers of the past few years. These are the Nike Dunk High in the vast gray colorway. As you can tell, I do love a good pair of Nike Dunk Highs. Next up, we have the Nike Dunk Low in the St. John's colorway for the University Red. Uh, the quality on these is excellent. Next up, we got a premium Air Force One in the brown colorway. As you can tell, I went a little cuckoo for brown sneakers. These are one of two Solomon sneakers that I have. Uh, this is the Solomon XC6 in the apricot colorway. If you are on the fence about Solomons or you are interested in trying them out, I highly, highly recommend you do so. Okay, so I switched columns here. Um, these are the uh, 2002 R's in the protection pack colorway. One of the best sneakers that I've ever owned, Air Jordan 1 Pollen. Not a shoe that I've worn a ton of, but the quality is nice on these. One of my favorite shoes, I bought these just as I started working full time um, after university. These are the Air Jordan 5 Black Metallic. The Nike Blazer Mid Jumbo. Love this shoe too. It's a great updated version of the classic Nike Blazers, which is a shoe that helped put my YouTube channel on the map. It's my most watched YouTube video, or no, my second most watched YouTube video. Um, so you can check that styling video out. These aren't a pair of New Balances. They are a pair of the Air Jordan 3 in the black cement colorway, um, a shoe that is very necessary. Um, this is a pair of the Air Jordan 5 
in, what's this colorway called again? The, the gray tongue? Fire Red, Fire Red 5s. Nike Air on the back, quality is really nice on these. One of my favorite sneakers of all time, a shoe that I don't wear a ton, you might hear me say that a lot, um, but uh, the Air Jordan 11 playoffs. This is a pair of the Air Jordan 3 in the true blue colorway. These have started to yellow really, really bad and really quick. Next up, you guys can probably tell by the box, these are the Air Jordan 1 Lost and Founds. I absolutely love that shoe. It's great. It's one, it's like a must have. Nike Dunk High Russet Brown, uh, dark russet. Uh, very um, good quality shoe, but not, not my favorite colorway. That one's tough to rock in my opinion. This shoe right here in this box is one of my favorite pickups ever. Nike Craft General Purpose Shoe in the yellow colorway. If you are on the fence with these, you need to buy them. You will th thank me later, please. Such a, an amazing, amazing, amazing shoe. Another pair of New Balance 2002Rs. They're one of my favorite models, so I bought them. One of my most worn shoes of the past few years as well, the olive and brown colorway. Okay, moving on to the next column of shoes. Um, I got some heat at the bottom of it too, so um, I can't wait to show you guys. This is one of the worst boxes ever. <laughs> New Balance 550 ALD. Um, I got these ones um, for the low, which was a good pickup for me at the time. And it is the um, Air Jordan 1 Bloodline. Another pair of 550s, this is the white and black colorway. I absolutely love these, they're super wearable. I got them about a year ago and um, another one of my most worn shoes. This is one of the oldest sneakers that I own. It is one of the first ever hyped dope shoes that I bought in uh, 2012. And uh, yeah, it's one of my favorites of all time as well. So that was a good like first shoe. This isn't uh, a pair of the Air Jordan 3s. This is instead the Air Jordan 6 Infrared, the 2016 version um, with that pink instead of the actual red. But uh, that's that shoe. This one is a pair of the Air Jordan 7, another one of the oldest shoes that I own, Air Jordan 7 Raptor colorway. Um, being uh, from Toronto, the Raptor colorway of the Air Jordan 7 is an absolute must. This is the first pair of Solomons that I bought, and it is the blue and beige colorway of the XT6. This is the anniversary colorway of the Air Max 1. Another great shoe, but it is a half size too big, and uh, I can't get rid of them. Another one, one of my most favorite sneakers of all time, the Air Jordan 11 Concord. I remember when I bought these, I was so excited to get them. Next up, um, much better ALD box, I'll tell you that much. This is the 650s, um, another one of my most worn sneakers. We have the New Balance 990 V3, made in USA. This is the Daytona colorway, great fun summer shoe. The Air Jordan 1 Ama Manier. I picked these up this year. Uh, my fiance bought them for me. It's now time to get into the remaining pairs of sneakers. These are shoes that typically don't have a box, but let's kick it off. One of the most wearable sneakers of all time, Reebok Club C Vintage. You guys saw the, uh, the Alma Manier Air Jordan 3. This is one of my favorite sneakers of all time. This is another deep cut. Uh, this is the Nike SB Dunk Low Dusty Peach. Very fun shoe. Another pair of Adidas Sambas. This is the Wales Bonner collab. And then the remaining two pairs up there are the Nike Dunk Low Panda and the 2002R Dusty Black or Ashy Black. We got probably my favorite sneaker of all time, which is the Air Jordan 1 Bread and the Yeezy 700 analog colorway. New Balance 997, less is more mint color. This has got like Kith Club written all over it, but it's a GR colorway. Two pairs of Converse Chuck Taylors. Obviously, it's the Chuck 70 version. We got the Air Jordan Run Mocha and the Air Jordan 4 Bread. I got the Nike ACG Mountain Fly Low, and then two colorways of Air Max 90s, the Infrared and the Neon. All right, it is giveaway time. I'm giving away the Air Jordan 1 Stealth Gray, size 8.5, never been worn before. I'm giving away the Yeezy Foam Runner, size 9 in the ochre colorway with a replacement box. I'm also gonna be giving away the New Balance 550 and the Stealth colorway. These have been worn. Uh, these are a size 8.5 as well. So, uh, rules to enter are very simple. 
All you gotta do is follow me on Instagram, number one most important thing. Number two, you gotta leave a comment on this video what your Instagram handle is because that's how I'm gonna be contacting you and you gotta leave your, uh, what country you live in. So rules are super simple, that's all the two steps that you gotta do and the winner will be announced on Instagram and uh, I'm gonna be drawing the winner February 14th, 2023, which is two weeks from now. So, thanks so much for watching the video. Um, and I hope you guys enjoyed the collection as much as I did and the home tour. So thanks so much for watching.